Welcome, folks, to another edition of Tiffin Box TV. I'm your host, Seishu, and I speak with photography industry leaders who make it a habit of inspiring others, bridging craft and commerce to help you create a sustainable and creative business. Today's guest is Jamie Swanson of The Modern Tog. You've heard of her before. She is an incredible photographer, a leader, a teacher. She's one of my mentors, and I'm so happy to have her here. Welcome to the, welcome to the quick chat here, Jamie. Thank you, Seishu. I'm so happy to be here, and I'm so, uh, so thankful for how I've gotten to know you over the last couple of years. So it's been really fun. Oh, well, yeah, I know. It's been more than just a couple of years. I think it's been more like five or six or, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> a long you time. Know, in the beginning, I've really appreciated you. Absolutely. Thank you so much for, for being here. One of the things we're going to talk about, really, is uh, the idea that you are going to be retiring a, a very, very a popular course called Market Tag. And uh, this is something you launched several years ago. I've talked about it here on Tiffin Box and a lot of my uh, my audience have signed up, I know. Uh, and this is, this is a, one of those cornerstone courses that photographers should consider. Let me ask you though, who is Market Tag for? Okay, so um, let me start by telling you who it's not for. Okay. Because that way I know it sounds backwards, but that way it's really clear. Because it is for a lot of photographers, but it's not for everyone. Um, so Market Talk is designed specifically for portrait and event photographers, or really anybody who is um, taking photos of the same person or like someone they love um, that's going to be buying them. So for example, like you could do pets, for example, if they love their dog, they want photos of their dog, and then they're buying the photos of their dog. It's not for people who are doing things like landscapes, where you're doing them and it could be for anybody. You could sell it to 100 people. It's really for when you're working with one specific client who wants something from you that's very clear. So it could be even commercial, okay. like if you're doing headshots for, S er, for CEOs, mm -hmm. um, that sort of thing. But if you're doing stuff like landscapes, if you're doing fashion photography, where um, you're hoping to sell the images to advertising or other things, um, if you're doing food photography, those are really a different ball of wax in that um, the way you market a business like that is more about audience building and it's less about finding specific clients to work with where you need to fill a large number of clients. Does that make sense? Yeah, Sashu? it does. It does. Absolutely. Okay. So, so it, it, um, I want to tell the people it does work for me, but at least that's who it doesn't work for. Sure, sure. Um, so the people that it is, there's really four four main camps of photographers who would find this beneficial. So even if you are a portrait photographer or an event photographer or whatever, you need to really fit into one of these four camps for it to be a super successful purchase for you, right? Because I want you to get more clients. I want you to actually make your money back several times over from this. And so um, I've kind of defined four types of people, photographers, that this is going to really work for. So um, number one, the there are people who are just starting out. Now, you don't have to be starting out. There are three more types. So hang, hang with me if you're not just starting out. <laughs> yep. But if you are starting out, or you've been doing this for a while and you are so overwhelmed by marketing and you just have no idea where to start. Like you are, you know you need to do it, you're trying to get your wheels going and you just, you need a path, you need somebody to walk you through it step by step. Marketog is a six week intensive plan where it's literally start at the first lesson, go to the last lesson and you are gonna have everything in order that I would recommend doing it ready to go for you and so it really helps take away all the confusion and that overwhelm and it's basically saying here take this do this yes even though some of the activities might seem a little strange at first this is the order you do them in and by doing them in this specific order you're going to have the best results so that's the first type of person those who are overwhelmed and don't know where to start second type of person that this is really good for is people who've been trying marketing but aren't getting any results because Marketog does a really good job of helping you fill in those gaps because a lot of times with our marketing it's just like when like our website goes down or something and you can try and try and try all these things but until you find the one thing that's really screwing it up yeah it's not gonna work right yeah, you know yeah. usually it's just in a website it's a little piece of code oh, yeah or indeed yeah right and yeah. so when you fix that everything else falls into place. Sure. And so the same thing goes with marketing. Um, and I've worked with over 90,000 photographers through either one of my free courses or 
uh, a paid course, not not 90,000 in market talk, but like 90,000 people who have engaged with some of my um, content and not just website visitors, that's huge. This is people who've actually opted in to take a course, whether it's free sure. or paid or work with me or whatever else. And I have found that a lot of times we start in the wrong places and when we miss some of those foundational things and those are the key things that once we have those in place, man, it just works. Everything else starts to come into action and work. So that's the second type of person who's been doing stuff yeah. and are frustrated because they're not getting results that other people are getting and they don't understand why, right? The third type of person that Market Talk is really good for are the people who are doing marketing. They're getting some clients, but they're not the clients that they really want to deal with. Like. They may get one or two good clients, but a lot of them are asking for price reductions, they're demanding, they don't necessarily resonate with your style, they're not your ideal clients. And so you want a better kind of client. You want to work with the ones that just make doing photography an absolute joy. Mm, and right. You, yeah, right? Because, I mean, we started this business because we like photography, and I know so many people who get really, like, a year or two into it, and they're just like, oh, this would be awesome if it wasn't for the clients, right? <laughs> because they get all these people who are demanding and asking for all this stuff and can I have raw files and can I see every single image you shoot and like all these things that you don't necessarily want to do and they want everything for nothing it's just it's not the kind of client you want to work with yeah and so this will help you clearly identify and figure out how to actually reach the clients that you love to work with that make doing photography an absolute joy right so that's the third type of person. Making sense, Paula? Yeah, absolutely. Right. Yeah, it's and great. Then the, the last kind of person that really benefits from Market Talk are the people who are already getting some of those awesome clients and they've already reached a level of success that most people look around and say, man, they are killing it, but you just need more. Like maybe you want to go full time and you're not there yet, or maybe you're full time and you want to figure out how do I increase my income? There's a whole section in Market Talk about how to really deep dive into marketing so that you can do it year round and really scale what you're doing. And so um, every topic that is in Market Talk is deep. I mean, this is super intense in terms of a course. And uh, in fact, you probably don't even need the whole course to be successful. I know a lot of people who've gotten through half of it yeah. and never finished, not because it was bad, but because they got so busy, they didn't need to do the rest. Like, you're like, I'm good, I got it all. And then when they really streamline that and want to start growing from that, they come back to it and then they start implementing some of the other strategies. Awesome. So it's it's good kind of for those four people. So people starting out who are overwhelmed and just need direction. It's good for people who are having troubles getting any marketing to work to figure out what's wrong. Yep. It's going to help you go from bad clients to awesome clients and it's going to help you get more of the awesome clients you're already finding. Awesome. Awesome. That yeah. sounds good. That sounds very convincing to me. I mean, I know a lot of photographers who are in one of those buckets, right? In one of those right. spots uh, who are who are struggling in, in finding their clients, finding the right clients for their business, uh, assuming they do sign up for Market Talk, mm -hmm. How would they gauge what is success for them and you know, what would make Market Talk a success for those photographers? Good question. So um, I think you need to come in knowing what you want to get out of it, right? So how many extra clients a month is it going to be worth it for you? Or how much is it worth if you could jump from getting like these clients that aren't really your favorite that might be a little hard to work with? And not everyone's going to be a difficult client, but you know, the clients who it's just not the way you want to work with them to having ideal clients, like how much is that worth to you? And so really with Market Talk, you get in what you, or you get out what you put in. Um, some of the activities I have you do are going to stretch you a little bit. I'm going to be honest because I am not one of those people who says, just copy what I'm doing exactly and you'll get the same results because right. your market is different than my market. Your love of photography and what you do is different than what I may love. And you know, you might live in a rural area where uh, high-end boutique, several thousand dollar per session booking doesn't make sense. You know, like that might work great in a huge metro area, but it might not work for you. And so what I do is I actually walk you through the process of figuring out what works best for you and your specific market and your ideal client, right? This is customizing it to where you are, who you are and what you want your business to be. Because I truly believe, after working with all these photographers that I've worked with, that there are 
far more than just one way to be successful and that it really like so many people follow others who just say just follow me and you're getting the same results and if you don't get that result it's like well it's your fault you didn't do it the right way and that's just not mm, true it's right. not realistic right and so it'll you really do have to do some legwork but that's why I have our study hall group and for the six weeks of the course I am in there I'm going to be active answering every single question that comes along which is crazy I know but I am going to answer every single one that's yeah. part of why I charge a lot for the course because yeah. I do get so much feedback sure and so the materials are gonna stretch you to think like I'm not gonna say just you know run this Facebook post and write these exact words and you're gonna get the same results because you might not right. I'm but I'm gonna help you figure out okay what exactly do we need to be doing do we do Facebook do we do Instagram do we do email do we do SEO what do we do to reach the client you want to reach and then what do we say and how do we find them and we really custom tailor I custom tailorize tailor we can go with that customize, whatever it's a Jamieism right yeah, it is a Jamieism customize your marketing plan yeah. for you and your business so I think it, it really depends if you come into this saying I'm ready to really get serious about my business yeah. and I want extra clients we're gonna get you there and I've seen I mean I've seen people coming in who are just hoping to make 300 extra per month who within two or three years are making a full-time income and doing photography full-time and um, Jeanette actually there's a testimonial on my timeline you can read her story you know I had one guy his name was Wes he's awesome um, he was shooting weddings and babies and you know the traditional portrait stuff and just didn't love that and he said if I, he started to dream and said well if I could shoot people in costumes doing cosplay right this is like the tiniest little niche who are people who make elaborate costumes go to these conventions and yeah. get super nerdy which is great and fun he's like that's what I would dream of and now he's doing that right and he's made he's, he's turning people away because he books up so fast and so it's it's going to help you figure out what do you really want in your business and then make a plan for getting there. So it's not like a, hey, buy the course and all of a sudden, boom, magic. Yeah. You have to actually put in an effort or yes. you're not going to get results. Absolutely. But if you put in that effort, you are going to get results. And I actually guarantee it. If you do the work and you aren't getting results, I'm going to give you your money back because I'm not helping you. And I really want to help you. But you got to do the work because just buying it isn't going to get you results. I can promise you that right there. So. <laughs> Jamie, thank you so much for for explaining it all to us in, in, in such simple, beautiful terms. I, I think it makes a lot of sense now as to, uh, number one, what the value is in the course. Number mm -hmm. two, who it's for, obviously, who it's not for as well. And I've also learned, um, you know, in terms of making it work, uh, as photographers go, we are inundated with information and ideas and expectations mm -hmm. and our brains are everywhere, you know, and yeah. I think this course has the ability to focus, help photographers focus, pun intended, uh, <laughs> <laughs> to really to get into their business. I mean, really making yeah. their business their their front and center uh, project, you know, in a way. I think I love it. Uh, you know, I want to make sure that photographers get into this course and work on it, you know, mm -hmm. and yeah. understand that they are going to get what they put out of it, put put into it uh and it's it's heartening to hear about those who haven't even finished the course and have already seen success i mean that's amazing you know most mm -hmm. courses you have to go all the way through the end and and really like say okay i've done it i'm i'm now putting it all into action but it's amazing that you can actually put things into action as you're doing the course and then seeing yeah. the results right away uh, that's phenomenal i think i love that part as well there's so many things to love about this course uh yeah. but but the but the but the thing that I want people to understand is this is the last time you're offering it. Yes. Uh, so, uh, and I'll speak to that a little bit because I, I don't want people to be like, well, why are you not offering this anymore? Right. right. Yeah. So I'm uh, this past year, I've really been pretty honest with myself. I've started. I don't know if it's like the midlife crisis that you go through or whatever, because not a crisis really, but just really being more introspective and saying, OK, well, who am I? Like when I started this business, blogging was the way to do it. And mm -hmm. I hate writing. I hate writing you know and it's just like oh, I don't want to blog I want to do live videos and I have found that um, market talk is a fantastic course but I started a membership site where what I what really makes me like come alive yeah. is building communities yeah. and really getting to know people 
And Market Hog is awesome in that it is super intensive and I get to work tons with the people in the course and you start to get to know them and it's awesome and then it's done and yes. you're like, then yeah, now what? Now I have to sell them something else to keep working with them and that just, it rubs me wrong, right? And so I'm, I'm putting all my eggs in a membership basket where I can work with people as long as they want to continue working with me. Um, and that isn't open right now. So if people are interested in that, you got to wait till November. Sorry. But because I know that there are a lot of people out there who haven't taken Market Tog, who've been waiting for the next one to come, I want to do it one more time. And I, I do love Market Tog. It's a fabulous course. But um, when I'm honest about what I want to be doing and where I want the modern Tog to go in the future, sure. I want to be doing relationship building and I want to build communities and I don't want to just sell, 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 sell all the yeah. time. And so Market Hog is awesome. And for some people, it's actually a better fit because they are ready to come in, dig in, get her done and start yeah. seeing results right away. Right. And it's perfect for that because you can, you know, it's released a week at a time. But in those six weeks, you can implement as you go and you can get tons of results really fast. Um, and so really, it's it's just a personal decision saying when I look at the future of my business, even though, you know, I can sell this very awesome course again and again and again. I don't want to do that. I want to be really building relationships and working long term with people, which is a little different structure. Um, so that's why I'm doing it. But I'm doing it one last time. Last time, I'm not selling it after this. I'm not going to say that and then, you know, sell it under the radar. A little secret Christmas sale, perhaps? or no. Yeah, no, it's not coming back. I mean, it is done. It is it done. It is okay. done, done, done. And I am a woman of my word and I am a holden to that. So last time. Awesome. How uh, Thank you, Jamie, for doing this. Uh, I, I really, I've learned so much more about Market Dog now. Thanks for thanks for this quick chat You're with welcome. you, and uh, I look forward to seeing you in the in the community forum. So yeah, and and I will just just to give you the date. Sunday is the last day. In case people didn't get it, Sunday the twenty fourth, the last day to get in. Monday the twenty fifth of September is when course class starts. So yeah. um, just to make that clear, that's. If you want in, 24th is the date. Awesome. Great. Thanks a lot. Take care. Thank you, Stacey. Bye. Bye.